Welcome back to Aura Fury. I've been absent for a few days because we've been dealing with uh, a death in the family. Thank you all very, very much for your comments on my settings. And one thing people said, and I've got Aladark and Econ Brony on, uh, you know, in the talk chat with me, and I'm going to ask them, is that they said that when I get to the settings, I've got my... Uh, FPS set at unlimited and they said that it's going to put a huge strain on my CPU and that the best thing to do is to put the FPS at 60 which is what I'm recording at guys do you think that's right yeah we've I... heard the same thing yeah so I'm going to set my FPS to 60 for this recording can I ask me where are you guys? Uh, in the game? Yeah. I mean, well, yeah. <laughs> f physically, I'm looking uh, yeah. at a dark at our absolutely beautiful base. Absolutely gorgeous. I mean, it's really looking stunning. Uh, you and Strom have done a superb job on this. Uh, but... Yeah, we have actually an artist in residence right now. Oh. Yeah, uh, WKP. Uh, yeah. And he's been doing a little bit of animals, and you can check out Mutu One. I and, can. Uh, I can check out what Aladark. Uh, the uh, Two Zero One. He made a few sculptures there, and uh, he has been adding uh, a few animals around the house. In our yeah. place. How yeah. Wonderful. Yep. Yep. So did you say room 201? Yep, exactly. Yep. Okay. Right. You should in... have a little surprise when you enter. <laughs> He's in the inn, is he? He's what? In Is he in the inn? Is he staying? Uh, yeah. Does he have his yep. own room in the inn? Yep, yep. He started, uh, uh, he claimed one of the rooms. Yep. Oh, how nice. Your inn is becoming very popular. For itinerants like me. Oh, look at the table. We have a cake in the middle. No, it's actually an, uh, well, it's it's uh, if you think of the uh, American time in October, there's a uh, oh, it's a turkey. A yes, yeah. I see it. I see it now. Um, yeah, yeah, it's got little white feet and a beak and everything. Oh, fantastic. <laughs> so we're getting ready for Thanksgiving. Exactly, and uh, there's a new animal sitting by the staircase. I can see it. What is it? It's a dog. Uh -huh. It's a dog. Uh -huh. I can see it. Yes, you have to get it at the right angle. Oh, this yep. is our new artist in residence. Yep, exactly. And what is his name again? Uh, w -K -Q -P. Uh, WQP. Quentin. Oh, I know uh, Quentin. Yeah. I've been yeah, watching. Quentin. Yeah, I've been watching yeah. Quentin stuff on um, the screenshots in the Discord server. Is that great? Wow. Oh yeah, he's he's very talented. You wow. can see on the um, the the pier outside. I, I will uh, do. But... He made he made some uh, chairs also. Rocking chairs over there. Okay, I will have a look, but at the moment I'm looking at this beautiful wallpaper, and I think you made oh, yeah. that wallpaper. Yeah, I did. Uh, basically, it was the essence of the uh, world place, which is basically a little bit of water and sky. So I yes. made a, a little cloudish. Yes. Cloud yeah, I see the clouds. Cloud. Yep. And uh, made the. Well, it could be either wave or a month, and depends how you see it. Yeah. But uh, uh, I wanted to make a wave of a repeatable wallpaper that I could lay on the side yeah. of the all the way in the end. So it's I'm gorgeous. Quite happy with the result. What is the what is the material that the wave is made out of? Uh, polish, uh, polish. Uh, Andesite. And the site, yep. Yeah. And uh, then there's plaster, chalk, yeah. and do I forget one? That's fine. Uh, and sandstone. Sandstone. Sandstone, 
for the for the um, right. page yellow uh -huh. at the bottom. So I found we... that sound. Yeah. Does Quentin make videos? I don't think he does. Do you think he'd uh, mind if I videoed his stuff? I don't think he would. Okay. Uh, to be honest. Well, let's look at room 201. WQP, Quentin. Oh, my word. Oh, guys, look at this. <laughs> we have another little dog sitting here. How cute. And he's got bookcases. And I love the combination of the Lily of the Valley and the Celadon flower pot. That's so pretty. And then there's a little dog on the wall that's andesite gravel. Doesn't that work well? And the dog on the bookcase is stinky. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if it's a dog or a rat, to be honest. It's it's a bit of, of both. Uh, yeah. Wow. Depends how you see it. Yeah. I'm just going to check whether anyone's put anything in my bedroom that shouldn't be there. I'm loving my bedroom, by the way. Thank you so much. I absolutely no love it. And I love the pots with ash on. It's just such fun. Um, yeah, I, I heard you in the actual the video with Econ, so I yeah. had to buy them and put them in. I tell you, everyone's insane on Vintage Story because I put up a test video that I thought maybe a couple of people would look at, not very many. Yeah. But when I um, looked at it, uh, there's over a hundred and I think it's 120 people have seen it so far. It's just wow. absolutely astonishing. I think this feels a bit more jerky to me. I've also been admiring your ovens. Oh, Primantine oh, yeah. got killed by a drifter. Oh, <laughs> whoops. Okay. I think the ovens with the uh, lit fire is absolutely brilliant. They just look like, they're not ovens, they're wood-burning stoves with the yeah, pot on no. the top. They're yep. brilliant, absolutely brilliant. And I love the cooking utensils hanging from the shelf above. So the ovens are mine, but yeah. the utensils are a WKP. Oh, right. Uh, and yeah, a frying pan. Made... My goodness. Yep. What a wonderful pan, combination. And, uh, yeah. And the meat, uh, what do you call it? The meat grinder or a meat? Uh, uh, a large you... wooden thing that you beat meat with. Yeah, yep. the meat tenderizer. Tenderizer, tenderizer. yeah. Yep, I can right. see it, yes. Good heavens. Such talent here. I'm going slowly because I I'm going to switch my settings back um, because I'm finding this a bit jerky. Okay. Let's try maximum fps i won't go the whole hog let's just see if that makes it a bit less jerky yeah, yeah that's smoother the, that's smoother lowering the ssao just a slightly bit or the shadows can help as well okay let me they, do that because they're they're the more taxing uh features really yeah. on the graphic card let's put medium quality because i use medium quality ssao on my single player world shadows i have off um okay that's fine yeah i'm thinking of buying a new computer too yeah that's that's a bit smoother all right now where is the pier oh so it's north uh north of the of the big dining table if you right. come out i've got it yeah lake. yeah it's a very small pier but it's in uh, construction Oh, I always like watching things in construction. Yeah. I, oh, there's I... a big project going on over on a tunnel system right now. Oh, yeah. Is that? Construction. Oh, I, yeah. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come and video that, guys. I'll tell you that. Sure. Oh, my goodness. Yep. I'm here at night. It's winter. It looks absolutely stunning. And I am going to starve to death if I don't nick, if I don't take some of your... Um, there's some Food. features of the vessels above the above the stoves. Yeah, I'll just take some of those. Yeah. Um, there we go. Let's find some. Do you know, I still haven't found anybody in my single player world who will sell me vessels. Oh, wow. I know. It's absolute nightmare. 
I've got so much rot on me. That sounds disgusting. <laughs> sounds like I've got some dreadful. When you're not in context, yes. It, yes. It could... Yes. Right. <laughs> right. Let me just fill myself up. You could hear me going. Um, Aladar, when I came on here for the test um, video I did, um, I was in awe of your wood burners. And I think this has got, is the orange block in the middle basalt? The wood burners? Uh, in the yes. kitchen, yep. yes. You've got yes. basalt and then what looks like sandstone and... Yeah. Bauxite. Uh, not not a uh, bauxite. It's bauxite in the middle, not basal. So it's bauxite is the orange one. Sandstone yep. is the yellow one. The but black it's the one. Polished. It's polished, polished bauxite. Yep. Right. Yep. Yeah. And then the sandstone, and then the um, oh basalt. Yeah. It looks absolutely yep. magnificent. And the other thing I was pretty well in ecstasy over uh, was in the forge and I think that these pillars you have uh, the where's the forge pillars here we go all right there we go I'm going slowly then I don't you know sort of mess up the pixels here but the basalt rock but the rock with it I thought they were stunning these pillars so it's basalt, but what is the white rock? Is it limestone? Yeah, it's polished uh, yeah. polish, uh, limestone with I mean, uh, polished basalt, I think. Absolutely stunning, guys. Absolutely stunning. And it's really fantastic. I think that uh, Stainless Fool mm -hmm. ought to copy these supports in his Egyptian temple because they had oh, that yeah. oh gosh Primantine's having a good day he or she yeah. got killed by a wolf oh gosh but I thought that these would be fantastic in an Egyptian temple they've got that wonderful Egyptian look to them I thought it's absolutely gorgeous oh, nice. gorgeous yeah so I love both of those so we now have an artist in residence and I'm and the pier is on our property, right? Yep. Yep. Yeah. It's amazing how the small details are making this property look even better. That we've got the stones surrounding here. We've got little stone. Uh, they're not gate posts because there's no gate, uh, but here you've got pots with the lily of the valley in. And I think that the we've got shells everywhere. And I think yeah. that the lamp posts are an absolute triumph, and so many of them. But can you explain to me why the raccoons don't come and eat the beehives, the honey? Is it because they're yes. on fence posts? Exactly, because the fence posts count as two blocks. Ah. Oh. And, and they cannot claim two blocks, so it's a bypass kind of. How fantastic. So, so since I, they're on fence posts, I don't need to fence the whole B area, which makes it more open. And it looks beautiful. Absolutely Thank beautiful. You. And I can see that we've got the surrounding areas lit up a bit at night. I can see lights here and there. Yeah. Absolutely well, gorgeous. Look at this build, a, guys. Yeah. We have a whole road system lit up now. Uh, with uh, really lampos and mine wow and, uh, even from wallspawn to where me and econ are working right now and uh it's it's all lit up with uh um lampos. econ hello i can see you hello yeah, i'm running in between bases right now to get materials wonderful <laughs> a flying econ disappears into the darkness of the night it's wonderful you can see him running in the distance along the lit path. Isn't that lovely? Oh, a light in the darkness. So where are you guys working at the moment? Uh, on a huge tunnel. Oh, uh, wonderful. I can uh, take you over yeah. there if you want on the way back. 
because oh, I'll yeah. just be a moment, uh, grab some wood and then I'll be heading okay. right back. I would love that, to. Yeah, great. Yep. yep. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put these videos up in um, short videos and then they'll be easier to upload. Uh, I suffer from a an internet that comes down a telephone wire. Oh, I live DSL. in I live in the middle of a city in England in 2020. I live in Chichester and my internet comes down a telephone wire. I can't believe how far behind we are on internet cabling in the UK. It's an absolute disgrace. Anyway, enough of that. That's my problems. I'm going to say bye bye on this video and then Econ, I will uh, grab some food and wait for you to pick me up on the way back. Okay, bye. I'll bye. be about three, four minutes. No problem. It'll give me a chance to get some food. Bye bye, guys.